And this is our new equipment reservation system called RuShare. Current members of NCTV should have received an email with a username and password to access this system. If you did not, please contact us. When you click Request Equipment Online at the top right of our website, it should bring you to this login screen. Go ahead and click Login and enter your username and password. Your username should be your first initial and last name, all one word. The first thing I'll point out here is how to change your password, which I suggest doing so it is something you can remember. Click on your username at the top right and click Change Password. Enter your current password, your new password, and confirm. This screen, you can also change your contact information like your phone number and email. Click the Production tab to reserve equipment. Every equipment reservation has to be tied to a production. If you have multiple days of shooting or are working on a long-term project, you do not need to add this production more than once. You can reserve equipment for long-term projects simply by clicking on Edit next to that project name. Click Create New. Name your production. You can add a description if you like, but it's not mandatory. And select a production type from the drop-down. Then click Create. At the bottom of the screen, you'll see the Reservations tab. Click Add Reservation. This dialog box pops up, and you can enter your start date, which is your pickup date, the time you want to pick up, your end date, which is your drop-off date, and the time you're going to drop off. Reservations are limited to five days maximum, but please only take gear out for the days you actually are going to be using it so other people may take advantage. On the right-hand side, you have to select a crew member, which is yourself. The Equipment tab here, you can start checking off the gear that you'd like. You can either type in keywords and search for the item this way, or you can hit Select Categories and check off the categories that you want to see. You have to hit search when you do this. You can select a quantity if you want more than one of one item, and you can hit this plus here to see a description of the item. Once you have everything you need, you can hit Request, and then you can hit OK. If you forgot something, you can click Add Reservation again, and if you haven't left this screen, it will remember the same pickup and return dates that you've entered. Another feature to point out here is the launch reservation calendar. This is useful when planning ahead. It will tell you what gear is taken already. The best thing about this new system is that it will not allow gear to be double booked. Under the production tab, under base assets, you can add items that you take out frequently so that you can reserve the same gear for multiple shoots without having to search every time. Now when you click Add Reservation, you have a tab called Base Configuration, and your items should appear here. You can reserve a studio or an editing computer under Facilities. The Packages tab is not in use at the moment. Now that we've made our reservation, click the Home tab. You can check on reservations here under the Attention box at the bottom right. You can also see items you have checked out and items overdue here. Do not worry about the Classes tab at the top right. That is not being used at this point in time. That's the basic run-through of RuShare. If you have any questions or need help, call the station at 413-587-3550.